you want so new haul now I know I don't think that my last one was a long time ago but I just I have to share things because I'm so happy right now so uh, I discovered a channel in like a couple I think it was like a week ago something like that and it's called like Lacry Fine Art and I will put like um, the name below or like I will put the link to her channel somewhere and I really like what she's doing. Like she's really into like realistic, um, like artwork, a lot of animals and things like that. And she's using color pencils all the time. And I loved. I mean, like everyone was talking about Prisma color pencils, and I really wanted to try them. But then I discovered this channel, so like Refine Art, and she's she's saying that now that she's really now that she has discovered the polychromos pastel uh, pastel the polychromos color pencils she's really into them and she doesn't really love that much of the prisma color pencils so in my head like in my mind i was like okay the polychromos are super easy to find here and the prisma color you can't find them in france so i was like yeah maybe i should like get into color pencils again i really like them um, I really I stopped using them because it's extremely long to do artworks uh, with color pencils compared like to using Copic markers. It's super super long, but I really like how it looks. The thing is, um, when I use them, like um, so I have all, all of like I have my chart here. This is the color that I uh, that I had before uh, buying new colors. So this is my chart, and I will put a link to this like in the description below because I was look on the hunt like for an official like Fabio Castell chart, empty chart like you can find for copying markers as well, and I couldn't find any. I only found like uh, like a computer colored chart or like nothing really real to me. Nothing really I like, can use, so I found this online. Someone just was like me, wanted to do it, like wanted a chart. She basically did the chart for herself and she was kind enough to share it to the world so people can use it. So um, I will put this in the description below. The only thing that I can't, like, there's not the number, but like, the chart has no number, the number of the colors. So I added this because I think it's really great to have this. also the, 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 the number. But yeah, I have all this, and I used to like do like uh, a lot of things with that. Like, I mean, like my color pencils, I have them. Like some of them are in this pencil case for seven years, something like that. So I used them a lot when I was in high school for a lot of projects, and then I discovered copy markers and like all this magical world, and I kind of stopped using them. But I really, really like color pencils, and I really wanted to go into that again because. I don't know, the, the technique and the look of it, it's really, really, there's something really specific about using color pencils and you can achieve so many results with them uh, that you can't really have that result with, with Copic markers. So this is why I'm getting into color pencils again. And the thing is, to really work only with color pencils, this chart is a bit like, um, I mean, I really just need more colors. So this is why I did a little purchase. <laughs> I went a bit crazy, I have to admit, but um, I didn't get co like color pencils for, I don't know, years and years. So I really, really, like I always wanted, like for the past like five years, I was like, oh my God, I need new colors, I need new colors. So I finally decided to get new colors. And as you can tell right now, I have a lot of them. And this is not really organized, but um, I basically just had to get um like all the empty spots like you see i have like some red and like some blues and like all the greens here is really really empty so all those like i just had to complete my little set of colors and i also get some extra like new one because um some of them are really short like this like this one is pretty short i also have this like orange uh this one oops this one is pretty short. I don't think I ever... I don't think I got this again. Why? Why did you forget this color? That's... It's, it's fine. Maybe I have like a double or something like that. But anyway, uh, some colors are a bit short. So I had to replace them. Like flesh colors and like some red. So I also got the white because I, I didn't have a, I didn't have a white. So we really wanted to get this. Now, I really don't think I can name all the colors. It's going to be pretty boring. But I have like a lot of more greens and browns and a lot of purple because I already have like, I only add two purples on my chart. I really can't wait to use this one like, this really pale purple looks absolutely magnificent. So this is light magenta, oh my god I can't wait to use them. 
and I will also like do more like um, color pencils artwork because now that I hold those the color like I have all those colors I can do magic things with them. The only thing now my problem is that I don't have anything to store them, <laughs> so I might just have to get a box or something like that because I can't put them in this pencil case. It's gonna be too big, and I'm pretty sure this can't fit. <laughs> But anyway, so I got color pencils, and then the three other things I got, so I got um, a little sketchbook. Now, this thing is not for me. This is for the 10,000 subscriber giveaway, and I just eat like 9,000, so it's getting extremely insane on this channel. Every time I... basically what happened is that when I comment on other artists' video, and I'm getting a lot of hate for that, but I also... I'm also getting a lot of free advertisement and I'm not even trying to, I'm just commenting what I see on other videos, art related or not, but I always have like a huge amount of thumbs up, which basically means that I'm in t on the top section and people are just clicking on my name and they see that I have a channel and my artworks and I gained a lot, like I gained a thousand subscribers in one month, which is insane. And I don't even have any control on that. It's pretty it's pretty amazing. So thank you for any new subscriber, <laughs> whether you're coming from like art video or like anything else. But I'm so happy uh, to be able to share my work to more people. And I want to reward everyone, but I can't do that. So I'm waiting for 10,000 subscribers and judging by the rate of like the, the growth of the subscribers, this can happen like in like at the end of this month or maybe middle September or something like that. I've been like collecting items for the giveaway for this past few weeks and I will also get more things like this month to have this huge like price art supply uh, giveaway thing for 10,000 subscribers and I so I got like, this little sketchbook. I didn't want to get like a big big one because it's extremely uh, it's expensive to ship things, but I still want to give you more than just my art book, you know, so that's why I got this. I also will give Copic Markers. There's a lot of things going on, but yeah, so I got this thing. I really like, I have something similar, so I got you the small version. And so yeah, this is for you guys, for one of you at least. Then I also got this magical thing. So this is the Daniel Smith Watercolor Ground. Now, I have a problem with watercolors, is that I'm forced to work on paper and when I work on paper I have to like to mount it I have to like stretch and mount then and when it's finished and like it's extremely fragile basically and um, I'm working with the gallery and they want me to do like watercolors on canvases and watercolor canvases are extremely expensive and they don't sell that in my country so I will have to sh buy them in a different country and you can't really ship canvases which basically means that um, I wanted something to use as a base on like my canvas, my canvases to make it like watercolor canvases. And I found this thing. So you put this, like you will apply any gesso or any base coat on anything. It works also on any kind of material. You can put this like on paper or like metal or wood, and you can turn anything into a watercolor base. To paint what to paint with watercolors, how cool is that? I'm just a bit disappointed because it's pretty small to me. Uh, so I hope I will not use like a lot of it when I um, like prepare my canvases. But now that I have this and I have a lot of canvases, I now I can just like waste a canvas, basically, <laughs> and try watercolor with like and try to put this and then try watercolors without uh, ruining my expensive paper. So I have this pot and I really hope this will work and it's pretty expensive, it's like $32 or something like that so I hope this works because it's extremely small for the price but um, this is the only thing I can find that is doing uh, like this this special watercolor ground, this is the only brand I can find. I hope this will work and the last thing that I got is this just little fixative for like uh, pastel char charcoal, graphite and colored pencils because mine is running out pretty empty now and since I'm getting into color pencils now more than just like before <laughs> more than before um, I need a new fixative because I don't want to like smudge all my artworks when it's finished especially because when I send them like when people are bugging artworks I need them to be really protected 
so I needed a new fixative and that's the last thing that I got guys uh, yeah, I think that's it for the video. Hope it's not too long, too boring. Um, if you have any questions, if you want me like to um, do like tutorials on color pencils or any kind of review, please tell me below. I will do it as soon as possible, and uh, I will also like insert. I will insert the chart somewhere so you can just use it if you want. And I will also name the colors below, but uh, I don't think that's really important. I don't think you're going to use that information. Uh, but uh, basically, uh, I think I have almost all the colors. I only The only thing I didn't get was the cool gray and like some brown, but I, re I mostly have everything. So you don't really need like much information on what colors I got. I basically have almost everything. But yeah, I can't wait to do like artworks with them and... I think that's it. Thank you for watching, guys. Bye-bye.